Hi, I'm Dan Matarazzo and I'm an exhibit designer at the Liberty Science Center. And behind us, we're starting with the install of the Honeybees exhibition. So we have two colony boxes, two hive boxes outside and one observation hive inside. So those are three different colonies with three different queens. One of the key things for an observation hive is that it's indoors and the bees need to be able to get outside. So with that, they'll be going through a pipe here. And with that, they're able to fly out and then come in as they wish. My name is Joe Lolino and I'm with Bee Bold Apiaries and today we're installing our honeybees. The observation hive probably has about, well, maybe about four, about 4 thousand bees in it and the queen is beginning to lay her eggs so it's going to begin growing very rapidly. The commercial colonies probably have about, oh, about, maybe about 20, 15 to 20 thousand bees in each colony. But they will grow also, they'll grow to about 50 to 70 thousand bees by the time uh, August rolls around. So this is a blend of sugar, water, and I believe a little bit of lemongrass and mint, and uh, maybe possibly other essential oils. So this actually acts as a feed for them, um, especially in the winter or when they're establishing their colony, which they are now since they were just brought in. That's the, that's the important thing, is to know that they're first of all docile, they won't sting, they won't go out of their way to sting you. The only time they will sting is if you went to their hive and you gave it a kick. Then they would probably come out and they'd bump into you first to move you along, or if you didn't move, then they would sting you. But the real good reason for a honeybee, and you should remember this, is that they're there as a servant to mankind. They just want to go out and work and make it better for us. They've kept up their side of the bargain. We have not. Unfortunately, many bees are dying off each year. Uh, we've lost 30 to 40 percent right here in New Jersey and uh, by Liberty Science Center putting these bees here it puts more bees out into the field. People within two miles of the Science Center will benefit from these bees that are here today because they'll go out pollinating making everything much better than it ever was before.